they're enforcing the rules pretty hard here. I had to take off without him. Yeah, it's, it's probably just going to be me. That was a wild night last night. Hope you guys checked into that live feed. Unfortunately, the video got blocked, copyright blocked. It wasn't on my channel, so no time to be sad, but eh, I won't get to relive those memories, but it was really a lot of fun. Whew. A lot of drinking, <laughs> a lot of super chats. You guys were awesome. Anyway, we're headed to uh, Suratani today. We're in Krabi Town. Suratani after this, or, I'm sorry, we're in Alnam Krabi, not Krabi Town. Then we're headed to, uh, Headed to Suratani today. Should be a good time. Hang out with us. Have fun. Right now, I gotta get some breakfast in me. Deal with this hangover. What's up guys? James Casino Chocolate Man in Thailand. I'm almost all the way to Suratani, stopping at a PTT. My hands were starting to vibrate. <laughs> Feeling tingly, had to take a little break. Been riding for about an hour and a half. Got about another 30 minutes to go to get to Suratani with my man here. Uh, yeah, check this dude out. <laughs> awesome, right? And he's got a little friend over here. Let's go check him out. Ninja Turtle. I love these sculptures. They're all over Thailand, but they're they're pretty intricate. They're pretty cool. This dude's got straight up blades on them. Nice, right? <laughs> Always fun things here at the PTT stations. Anyway, check in with you guys. We get to the hotel. Okay, just looking around. There's a bunch of sculptures at this PTT station. This is pretty legit. Let's get them all. We got Alien. Hold on, let's go wide here. Yeah, here's Alien. <laughs> that's pretty dope man there's a couple more over here too let's check them out got some transformers even got a got a motorbike over here let's check it out check it out yeah this is the dude from transformers <laughs> legit yep another transformer i think this is optimus prime nice just look at that detail. I mean, how long does it take to even make one of these things, man? That is cool as hell. This is like a Predator bike or something. I don't know. Looks like Predator. Cool. Good stuff. Uh, I'm gonna try and pronounce the name. I don't know if I'm gonna say it right. <laughs> right, Tani, right, Rajtani, Rajtani, Rajtani Hotel. I don't know. Links down below if you guys want to check it out. But just be known, and with this hotel and probably with several other hotels, they follow the rules. So you will need a vaccine card to check in, as well as your passport. However, you can't show an antigen test or PCR test result, and you can also have a photo of your passport if you don't have the physical passport. So, but you're, they're gonna wanna see some, some proof of identification. You're gonna wanna see some, some proof of your health status. So be ready for that, which is very common. This is the gateway to get over to Koh Samui, which also has some very strict rules about getting on the island before you can go over there and party and get crazy in the blue zone. So no surprise that they're enforcing the rules pretty hard here. They don't want to mess it up. They want to keep it going, keep the party moving. So, and they don't want any more outbreaks and uh, anything hurting business. So completely understandable what they're doing. No problem at all. But anyway, let's take a walk around the neighborhood here, right outside our hotel. They do have this really nice cafe in here. I'll probably go check that out for lunch later because it looks really nice. Then we're right across the street from the mall. 
the Coliseum Mall. Definitely gonna go in there and check that out after I walk down the streets a little bit. Yeah, and the reason I'm walking around is because they also are not ready for us to check in, which is also not a surprise. Yesterday was Father's Day here in Thailand, which is also the King's birthday. And yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's just a very busy weekend for Thais for domestic tourists. So not surprised that our rooms aren't gonna be ready until 1 p.m. No big deal, no big deal. It's a busy little restaurant there, it must be popular. All right. Yeah, looks like Chuck picked a great spot for us. Kind of been a busy district here. Lots of places to eat, lots of shopping around here. Perfect, gonna be a good spot for the night. The boys aren't here yet, they're a couple hours behind me. They weren't feeling too well. A couple of them weren't feeling too well this morning after the uh, after the fun we had last night, hanging out at Yesterday Bar in Krabi. <laughs> for obvious reasons, no shocker, right? No shocker, I get it, no big deal. So yeah, they're, they're taking their time getting here. I had to get here, I got some things I gotta do here, so I had to take off without them and kind of be the uh, be the advanced man, no worries. All right, looks like I already found one potential hangout for tonight. This place looks cool, the Drunky Bear. <laughs> Steak and Burger Bar. Check out their motto right there. You'll never drunk alone. <laughs> we got a little English going on there, but hey, who cares, man? You're in the exciting Coliseum Mall here. Let's walk around. We've got a KFC, yum. <laughs> we haven't ate fast food on this entire trip. I love it. Uh, just got a text from uh, Joe. Joe and uh, Mitch, they're gonna go ahead and head back and they'd rather just get home. I think the really the really important thing is that Joe's foot gets looked at by the doctor soon. So we don't have any problems there. So just smarter for those guys to head back early. We're just gonna head back tomorrow, no big deal. We'll get the gang all back together, should be fun. Anyway, exciting mall here, they got a crepe station. Yum, yum, yum. Bookstore. All right, bunch of clothes downstairs. I don't think I'm gonna check that out. Let's go upstairs and see if they got an electronics section. That'll probably be more interesting. Or is it just more clothes? It's like a big clothes mall. Lots and lots of clothing that won't fit me. <laughs> oh, they got a movie theater in here. That's cool. I wonder what's playing. Not that I really want to go see a movie today. Okay, it's the standard mall. I'm out of here. <laughs> Not that exciting. Just trying to kill time. I think I'll hop on the bike and uh, ride around town and see what there is to see. Should be cool. Let's do this. All right, guys. Potentially our last motel of the trip. Nothing crazy, pretty standard, but clean and nice. Always very clean, I love it. They always do a really good job of cleaning, no matter how old or simple the room is, they're always really clean. Yeah, not a monster TV by any means, all good. <laughs> not the sexiest view, but it'll do, I got a view. I'm glad I got a window. Beggars can't be choosers. Decent, let's see how this bed feels here. Oh yeah, oh, oh tie firm. <laughs> Nothing like that memory foam I had last night. That thing was pretty good. Anyway, that's the room. Got a little refrigerator, big ass mirror, closet. Uh, no safe deposit box though. No, no, oh well. Not a big deal, not a big deal. And there it is guys. All right, the Rajtani. Rajtani, Suratani. All right, guys, what's up? Hey, we're out here at the uh, riverfront of Suratani. I got a feeling the river isn't supposed to be quite that high. <laughs> Definitely been a lot of flood water this year. This river is super, super high right now. Got a, got a feeling it's probably not always like that. Anyway, uh, love to get some drone footage for you guys over there, but my drone is acting up. Yep, I just got the damn thing, brand new. And it's got some kind of crazy camera issue. It didn't crash it or anything. It's just something up with the camera. I looked it up online. I guess it's a common error. Anyway, it's probably gonna have to go back to the store I bought it at for them to fix it. Moving on. Just checking out the waterfront here. Yeah. The boys are a little beat up from last night. They are just hurting too much. So uh, yeah, it's, it's probably just gonna be me. I hope that's exciting though. Yeah, just gonna be me check out the night market, walk around a little bit, and uh, yeah, it'll probably be an early night. And uh, we're gonna get up early in the morning and head back to Prachuap, all the way back to Prachuap, like 360 some odd kilometers. Should take us about six hours or so to get back. No biggie, no biggie. Ah, 
back to the lovely ladies, back to Klaus, back to the nice mountain. Maybe this time get, actually get in the swimming pool, which would be nice since uh, we haven't got any yet. And that's that, but anyway, let's go, let's go check out the rest of Suratani for a little bit. Come on. Pretty cool overpass, or I don't know, river bridge. I don't know. Pretty cool looking structure. I dig it. I dig it. Not sure what the name is, but yeah. Just uh, west of uh, Surat County here. Crossing the river. Interesting. Okay, I'm just I'm just looking for stuff to see now. Why not? Let's do it. Right, we are here at the city shrine. Check that thing out. Pretty dope. Little white temple right in the middle of the city. Amazing. Surrounded by elephants. <laughs> Catching it right at sunset. Pretty beautiful. All right, there's an idea. If you don't like how your light poles look, make them look like a gold tree. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Got a beautiful sunset about to happen here, right over this little bridge. This bridge looks like it lights up. I kind of want to hang out and see what that does, but I probably won't. <laughs> I probably won't, but I bet it looks cool at night when they light it all up gorgeous out here anyway we can go check out this river walk let's do it beautiful beautiful evening here in Suratani I think it's time to go hit that night market and that should be the big event for the night Woo! Are you guys excited? Let's go, let's go, let's, let's go. All right, I see Chuckles way up ahead of us here. We're gonna see if we can stock him down. It's gonna get awkward. <laughs> oh, look at the Dory Man cake. Fa would be going nuts for that right there. <laughs> Dory Man cake. Observe the male version of the Buddhist belly Texacanus YouTubist. Oh God, looks like we found one of the night markets. I'm not sure if this is the exact spot, but oh, those look good right there. I have to come and get some of those later. But yeah, we're gonna do a walkthrough first before I start eating everything in sight. Pretty crowded in here. I told you, those are good. Don't pass them up. Smells awesome in here. I wish you guys could smell it. You know, it smells like uh, fried fair food, you know, like uh, you go to the carnival, maybe frying up food. That's what it smells like. Really good. Really good. Lots of scents and flavors in the air. Super tasty. Mm mm mm. Oh, God. These little things are good too. Little corn, little corn puff things. Really tasty. Really good stuff. I know you guys are just sick of me showing you food all the time, but sorry. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. <laughs> all right, it looks like just one long street full of food. Food, food, and more food. Busy as hell in here, though. There's a lot of people in here. Social distance. <laughs> I'm sure that means something. Oh, they do got an alcohol dispenser right in the middle of, middle of the uh, road here, so that's important. I don't know if they're serving alcohol or bars open, none of that. I haven't seen any beer or anything on a table, so yeah, I must feel, still be under some kind of ban here. Oh well. Oh, look at the cute little mini pancakes. Those look cool. Not gonna lie, getting a little hungry. Might have to grab something to eat. 
Boo Show. It is smelling ridiculously good in here. So yummy. Oh no. Oh, they got my favorite chop or I love this stuff. I swear this stuff is like crack cocaine to me. Oh yeah, I'll be coming back for that. My absolute favorite. That fried pork is oh so good. Party party. Got that jamming music going. I just love how in between the food they got a little random t-shirt vendor. <laughs> but you know everybody's coming here for the eats. Street food bonanza. All right, you just missed the Thai national anthem. Of course, I didn't record that, but everybody stops. What they're doing, cooking, whatever, stands kind of, you know, peacefully and quietly, pays their respects. And then as soon as the music goes off, right back to the action. This is just not good for me. There is so much stuff in here I would just murder. Never come to a place like this when you're hungry. It's just not smart, guys. Not smart at all. The only thing I got going for me is I don't have fa with me or it would really be freaking out over here. <laughs> hey, baby. Thinking about you. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. Look at the bees. They got like a, they got like a, you know, the smoothie drinks over here, but the bees have just basically taken over. Look at them. These are all over everything in there. Crazy, look at them all. That's wild. <laughs> Must be really good juice, everybody wants it. They're, everybody's still willing to stand there with the bees flying around them while they get their juice, so it's gotta be that good. Right. Oh my. Look at those, look at those brownies. Oh, it so good. This girl's got all kinds of treats. Mm -hmm. A day without rotis like a day without sunshine, pilgrim. <laughs> Getting some more roti, baby. This looks good, too. They got, like, the fried roti here, too. That looks really tasty. I bet you could dip that like a chip or something. It's awesome. Put some salsa on it, what do you think? No? Maybe not? There's my roti. Getting it. Uh-oh. Looking good, yummy, yummy, yummy. Oh, he's gonna fold it up like a little taco there. Oh yeah, gonna make it easy to eat that bad boy. It's a cool little concept for a restaurant. You know, you just sit on the ground. They got their little fake candle lights. Got some lights strung across the ceiling. You get a sunset view, sitting next to the ship. That's pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Just, just make up some, you know? Whatever, it's all good. <laughs> Look at that sunset, look at those colors. Pretty amazing, right? All right guys, I don't know if I can top that. Look at that beautiful sunset. Whew. Walked around, checked out market, saw about as much random stuff I could see today. Drove around on the motorbike. I don't know what else to give you guys, man. Be so demanding. <laughs> it's all good, anyway. Uh, yeah, that'll probably be the end of the video unless I do something else interesting later on. If not, end of the video. Chocolate Man in Thailand. I'm out. See ya. Good night. Thanks for watching. Take care. I'm out of here. Bye-bye.